you darken the entrance to my tent, stranger. To what do I owe the pleasure? Oh no, my day hasn't been slow at all. I'm just currently on a break. Well, that's why the sign on my table says break time. No, 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 don't apologize. You look intrigued, and I am always happy to teach. Tell me what questions burn in your mind. Well, I do tarot readings, runes, I can do palmistry if you insist, but it is not my strong suit. Ah, uh, you're one of those. Yes, one of those. Those who think that tarot and runes tell you your exact future and that I scam people out of their money. Am I wrong? Well, you'll be happy to know that that is not what I do at all. You see, my dear, I do not tell you your future. I give you predictions. Insights into your path and your emotions. It is less of your destination in life and more of the journey. Do you see? Still don't believe me, eh? No, it is not just an act that I put on for the fair. I really do believe in this stuff. You're still skeptical. That's all right. It's hard to reject what you believe. Believe me, I know. But what if I showed you? Yes. A simple three-card spread. Past, present, and future. Oh, come now, don't roll your eyes. It'll be fun. Trust me. Well, that's why people come to the Renaissance Fair, right? To get away from the real world? Step into the magic a bit, my dear. Let me read you. Perfect. Now, I'll make you a deal. If you don't believe that my reading is accurate, then I will give you a full refund and you can be on your merry way. But, if my reading resonates with you and you have even a slight change of heart, you owe me a turkey leg. Sounds like a deal. Perfect. Now just sit there, and let me get everything set up. Are you allergic to incense? I find it helps clear my head, but if it bothers you, I won't light it. Wonderful. Now... Let's... Cutting the deck is important. I find it clears the cards of any energy left over from my previous patrons. I can see you giving me that look. Remember what I said. Step into the magic. Open your mind. Now... Close your eyes, run your hand over the cards, and stop when you want to pick one. Wonderful. Now for your present. Do it again. Good. And now again for the future. Perfect. 
You may open your eyes now. Now let's just set these aside. Ah 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 ah, no peeking. All right, now for your cards. You are present. The tower. A bad card? Oh my dear, there are no bad cards. Cards simply mean different things. The tower represents a sudden and dramatic change. Perhaps you've had a recent event that has shaken you? Ruffled your feathers? Shattered your foundations? Death of a loved one? Loss of work? Sickness? A sudden change that knocks you off your foundations, that's what the tower means. You must be questioning what is real and what is not. What you can rely upon and what you can't trust, right? See? You're already opening your mind. Now for your present. Oh my, the Seven of Cups. <laughs> the Seven of Cups has roots in choice, in illusion, fantasy, in dreams. You, my dear, are a dreamer. You dream creatively, perhaps even vividly. You're a wishful thinker, even in your darkest moments. Does that seem right? I guess. <laughs> Well, the advice that I give to you is to make sure your fantasies don't cloud your judgment in this realm. Do you ever find yourself wishing or hoping for something, but not fully doing the work to achieve it? Perhaps a fear of failure or a love of the fantasy keep you halted? I thought so. You must clear your mind. Keep your dreams in your head, but do not let them hinder your path. Dreams are wonderful things. They give us hope and motivation. But sometimes... I guess the old saying, too much of a good thing, has some weight here. Do you understand? Good. Now, your future. Ah, the Ace of Swords. I'm not surprised. Well, the Ace of Swords symbolizes a breakthrough, with its sharp blade representing the power of intellect. This sword has the ability to cut through deception and find truth. The path that you are on now will lead you to clarity and the truth. It's a green light to work on your goals, to seek justice, new possibilities. Oh, my dear, you will be all right. <laughs> like I said, the cards do not tell the future. They just help you along the path that you're on. <laughs> With that, how did I do? It's only a basic spread, of course, and there are always deeper meanings to the cards, deeper readings I could do for you, but I think for now, it works. Naha! See, I knew you would come around. Oh, please. I don't expect you to move to the woods and become an old hag who cooks children in a pot for spells, no. I just wanted you to open your mind to the possibility of something new. And you did. And that means you owe me a turkey leg. Well, I'm still on break. I have plenty of time. Of course. Lead the way. 
I'm looking forward to speaking with you more.